Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to convert WebP image files into other formats for free using a program called WebP Converter. So WebP files are a graphics file created by Google designed for websites, you know, to be smaller in size while still keeping uh, high quality images. But you might notice if you download some of these WebP files and you try and import them into other photo apps, uh, they're not supported and you need to convert them into something else. This is where this tool will come in handy. So there is a portable version of the WebP converter and also an installable version. So the choice is up to you. I have the portable one where you don't have to install it. You just download it, unzip it, and then run the WebP converter executable file. Like so. Then all you need to do is add files or a folder and then convert them. So I have this pictures file here. Let's start with just one at a time here and see what it does. Alright, so once you add your picture, click on Next, choose your output format. You see different options here. Let's say we're going to do a JPEG. You can even change the quality, uh, convert it to grayscale if you want, and then choose a different destination if you don't want to put it in the same folder. I'll just add it to the same folder, so we'll click on Process. Alright, so that's done. So now you can see over here we have the WebP file. So that's what it looks like. And then here's the JPEG file. You can see the name changed up there. So it pretty much looks the same as you toggle back and forth between them. Alright, so now we get to get this out of here. This will delete the image from the list here. It won't actually delete the file. Alright, so let's get rid of this here. Now let's add a folder, which we could do just by dragging it in here as well. You can see it expands all the file names. This time let's do some PNGs, for example. Okay, so five files processed. That's how long it took and how much disk space it used. Then you can see over here we have our image files, both versions. We have the PNG and the original WebP. Then if you go at the top, there's you know not too many options here. Just the same thing, add files or folders. Uh, display icons or not, include subfolders or not, and some help. Alright, so I will put a link in the description where you can download the WebP converter software and you can try it for yourself. Alright, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.